back now on Try Today. Time to visit with another good friend of the program. She's been here many times before. Always gives us great information. Jay Paul, our director. If we can meet our good friend Chantal Wesley, transportation demand manager for Park, who is just now as a new mom beginning to get a full night's sleep as the baby sleeps and rests. And congratulations on getting a full night's sleep. Thank you. Thank yeah. you so much. You look perky and <laughs> chipper. And hey, let's talk about the Triad Commute Challenge. We've talked about it a lot before. People say, yeah, we've heard of that. But hey, it's, there's a new one coming up. There's, it's time around to, to start talking about it again. There you go. Fourth yeah. time around. Yeah. Um, it's hosted by Park Course and Triad Air Awareness. And really our goal is to improve our air quality by getting people out of their cars. So we're talking and promoting things like biking and walking and van pooling, car pooling, riding the bus, of course, um, and encouraging people to do that over a three-month period at least one time. Now, of course, people at home will say, wait a minute, I, I might try that, but why are you here talking about what I need to do? I mean, is there a, do you go sign up or is there something I pledge to do or do you have some ideas on how I can... You know, is it organized or is it just something voluntary or what? Mm -hmm. It's very easy to do. Again, it's going to kick off April the 10th. It'll run three months, so through July the 10th. Um, and what the first thing you need to do is you need to make that personal commitment that you're going to try something different. Right. Um, once you make that personal commitment, you need to complete a pledge form. You can do that online at our website, partnc.org, or you can go in person at an event, and the list of those events are on our website as well. Okay. For all those who do come out in person, we're going to give them some free Try Commute Challenge, a bag a nice sports bag, as well as some free bus passes. And then the mm -hmm. final piece of that is you need to follow through with your commitment. And all those who do take the pledge, we're going to enter their names into some drawings for really great prizes, everything from entertainment tickets and, and passes and things like that to electronics. So. This is going to be great. Now, I, we'll, we'll put the information on screen a little bit later. I just wanted to, uh, don't want to rush the folks at home because you didn't mention the website. We'll give it to you in a second again because there's some logos and graphics I want to show you about some other things too. But before that, let me just sort of compare last year at the challenge. I mean, how many people participated and what are you looking for this year? Last year we had more than 2,500 people um, to participate and this year we're up in that ante to 3,500 and we know we can get there. That's just, that's just amazing. Now, there's something different. I think I was looking over some notes, something about a dash, a commuter dash. Tell me about that. Exciting, exciting stuff. It's our first ever commuter dash. Um, it's a three mile race slash walk. And we stress that because really, regardless of what your physical level is, you can come out and participate. It's a day event. It's going to be out in, Kerners, um, out in Kernersville at Triad Park. And we want everybody to come out, um, adults and kids alike. We'll have vendors, activities, food. We got Congressman Howard Coble, who's going to be coming in town to help us kick it off. Councilwoman Diane Bellamy Smalls is going to be right, out there. Right. So really just a lot of fun activity. The best thing about it, Jim, is that it's free, which is really unheard of for, for a race event. Isn't that great? So, yeah. And I love Triad Park, too. It has special meaning for me because my wife Pam and I sort of used to date there. Oh, okay. yeah, she didn't want to be seen in public with me, so we would wait until the park <laughs> closed. And we would, but that doesn't have anything to do with this segment, does it? So let's, uh, hey, what if a business wants to sponsor the challenge or host an event or something? How how do they do that? We need that. Um, the, um, the prizes that we talked about, they're all provided for by our sponsors, um, as well as the best way for us to spread our message and to get people to take the pledges is for businesses, community organizations to open their doors and let us come out and give away some things and, and that sort of thing and help us to spread the word. So people can call me at 662-0002. I'm sure you'll put that want, up. Yeah, and we also want to put your number, your phone number, but also the part Let's do that while we're uh, thinking about this. www.partnc.org. There's a logo and website up on screen for that. And uh, so you can get all the information about the dash and the event itself, the Triad Commute Challenge. And of course, we're talking about, before time wraps up, we're talking about you can ride a bike somewhere, you can try to cut down on pollution by doing that, you can, you can walk, you can, you know, there are all sorts of things. Take the park bus, anything like that will help, right? That's right. Yeah. So now are you going to do something to change? I mean, you're already... You already do all these great things. Are you going to do anything extra for the uh, personally? I'm going to do, do the as, walk. I'm going the... to do as much as I can. Now I will be out there on walk day. I'm doing some volunteers, so I can't participate myself. But I want you to come out. Oh yeah. You can walk. I can't run. <laughs> I can't run. I can. I can walk. All right. So www.nc.org for the fourth annual. Said fourth annual. There you go. Try a commute challenge. This is great for everybody. It's a win-win situation. Chantal, thanks for everything. Thank you so much. All right, sweetie. All righty. We'll be right back after this. Be a part of the clean air solution. Protect your health and the environment. Take part in the triad. 